everyone. Today we're going to make roasted cauliflower tacos together. The full recipe is from eatfresh.org and it is also linked down below in the description box. I like this recipe because it's a great way to eat more veggies, it's affordable, and you can also mix it in with your favorite taco meat to stretch your dollar even a little further. So let's get started. We're going to roast our cauliflower in the oven, so I preheated my oven to 400 degrees. After you wash your hands with soap and water for a minimum of 20 seconds, you'll wash your cauliflower. My cauliflower still had some of the leaves on the outside, so I removed those, and after I just roughly chopped the cauliflower into chunks. I will say that you don't want two small pieces, otherwise it will burn in the oven. Aim for medium to large chunks. There you can see I have my chopped cauliflower and I'm just laying it onto a lined sheet pan in one even layer. I make one flat layer so the cauliflower cooks evenly in the oven. Next, I added all of our yummy seasonings using my measuring spoons and added them to the cauliflower. Now I'll, I'm just mixing together all the seasonings and cauliflower. I'm using tongs but feel free to use your hands to mix it up. Once that's done, I'm going to pop it in the oven for 45 minutes. If you want it a little crunchier, you can do up to 60 minutes total. I will note that I pulled the cauliflower out about halfway through cooking to mix it up and also taste the seasonings. Now's the time to make any adjustments. You could also use this time to make a salsa or shred your cheese. Here is the final product that I served for dinner. I paired it with my favorite salad and I will say that they were pretty spicy for us um, with the full amount of seasoning. If you or anyone in your family don't really like to eat spicy foods, I would recommend starting off with half or even a quarter of the seasoning. When you taste the cauliflower halfway through cooking, then you could add any additional seasonings to your taste preferences. Overall, the tacos were so yummy and we were very full by the end of our meal. If you make these tacos, go ahead and share your experience with us by tagging us in your photos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.